Good morning everybody and welcome back to his last full day. Now I'm contemplating whether or not to have breakfast, potentially have lunch and then set off home later on because we have to be out at lodge at 10 o'clock in the morning. Why? I understand they've got to clean them. But if it was for the fact that I've been and told them that it were filthy, it will probably get cleaned better, me doing it. But anyway, so that's, that's what I'm thinking about this morning. I have got clothes on. I'm just sat with my cup of coffee. I've got some bacon and sausage in oven. Mm. Uh, so yes, yeah, so I don't know what to do. Because I can get a tan at home as, as well. And this position of this lodge is yeah, you get a little bit of sun but you don't get a lot of sun because it's got to work its way around so you get the sun at tea time so I'm in two minds of what to do Jamie's still in bed so once he wakes up I'm going to ask him what he wants to do but we are having some breakfast this morning uh, I did some washing yesterday I don't know how to do a washer dryer and when I looked, it said end. So I took the washing out, but the washing were really, really, really hot. And it was, they were still damp. So I don't know whether I were in the middle of a dry cycle. I don't know. Anyway, they went outside. They're on error, little error that they've got. Now, if I had a, if I had one of these myself, I'd have a proper big error. You know what I mean? Uh, that you'd be able to put a good load of washing on. Uh, but yeah, don't get me wrong. It's nice. It's it's been lovely. But would I would I go would I go again? I, I won't come here, but I would go again in a, in another lodge. Uh, so yeah, I would I would go again. Is that a hint to something? <laughs> uh, yeah, I have booked one, but I've not booked one for around here area. I've booked it for really really far away uh so we're going we're going away next year but we're going like we're going down south well, that's all you're gonna get but next year uh because i've had i've had to rearrange we were sat talking the other day about the holiday that we'd booked to turkey and i were a bit like yeah, but I've already been and we booked it on a whim and we shouldn't have booked it on a whim. We should have just gone back to Turkey, but to a different hotel. Anyway, I, I, I've cancelled it. I cancelled it. Uh, yeah, I've lost my deposit, my, my deposit, but... So I'm sat here talking and I uh, hear Jamie's feet. <laughs> sat in the bathroom waiting for me to finish. And I'm like, well, I didn't even know you were awake. Anyway, so... Yeah, so I, I cancelled that one anyway. So we're, we're just going to go to a different lodge every year. But we're only going to do Monday to Friday because Monday to Friday for us is enough. Now I might get to a place where I'm going to and I might go, oh, I should have stayed longer. Because by the time you get down, you, your Monday is your first night and then you do Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. So you're having three three full days and three full nights well three full days and then friday you have to be up and out and i'm presuming it will be for 10 o'clock to make your way back up home which i'm not bothered about that because it's we've had a, we've had a week away and it's like i've said i don't have to go to places i don't have to go to entertainment that will be alarm for the to turn the bacon over I don't have to go and sit 
in an entertainment se section to enjoy my life. I am, I'm not taking no babies away with me. I'm not taking no kids away with me. I, it's just me and Jamie. It's just a home from home, basically. That's what, but we will have to take more stuff with us next time we go because we are down south, as you call it. So we will be fur further away from home. Like here, we could be home in, in an hour and a half. You know what I mean? Whereas this one, it's 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 probably going to be quite a long stretch uh, that we've got to do to get there and get home. But we don't have to check in while four o'clock. We've not done the early check-in. So it's, it's four o'clock. So we can have a leisurely drive down. We can do pit stops if we want to tow. And we can get up, we can set off. And if we're there early, we're there early. We're just going to explore a little bit while this lodge is ready. But it is somewhere totally different. I have n I've not been, I've never been to this area. I've been down the, to the area, not in the area itself, but I've not been since I was like 13. Now I might go down here and I might go, oh my freaking God, I love this area. And then I might, my feet might get itchy. And I might have to move. Because <laughs> it's far. Anyway, I'm going to go, I'm going to turn my bacon over. We're having sausage, bacon, beans, tomatoes, toast. I've still got eggs, but I think if we do eggs, it's going to be too much. So we might have, we might have scrambled egg on toast for his dinner. Cause I'm going to use them before we go home. Uh, but I'm going to talk to Jamie about what he thinks we should do. Uh, because at the minute it is, uh, let's see what time it is. It's just, it's just coming up to 10 o'clock and I've only just got up like half an hour ago and Jamie's just got up. So would we prefer to stay in bed at home or would we want to be up and off? Cause we would be up and off, so we would be home for 12. Anyway, I'll see you in a bit. <clears throat> right, it's breakfast. Here's mine. And I'm gonna enjoy it. Right, that's it, I'm done. <clears throat> I've ate my sausage, I've ate my bacon. I've ate some toast. I've had some beans and I've had some, a bit of tomatoes. I can't finish it, I'm, I'm full. Like, full. Probably because it's protein. Maybe I should have just had half a slice of toast. Anyway, I'm gonna go, go put it all in dishwasher, set it off, and then see what we're doing. Because I've gotta wait, if I put dishwasher on, I've gotta wait then for pots to wash before we can go home. If we go home, if not, we'll stay well tomorrow. But we'll see. Right, <coughs> I've just had a couple of hours packing up because we have to be out first thing in the morning so I'm going home in a bit because I'd rather stay in bed in the morning in my own house than have to get up and be out for 10 o'clock so it says here check out please check out by 10 a.m. When have you ever t had to be at? I, I can stay in Premier Inn while 12. Where, when, when have you to be out of a caravan at 10 o'clock? Now, I don't, be my, I don't mind being out of a caravan at 10 o'clock if I'm far away from home. But 10 o'clock, I, I, I just don't get it. Anyway, I've got all the stuff packed up down there. I've packed it all up. Jamie sat down and and done note like per usual. Princess. All of the princesses, he keeps saying. Well, I said it last time, and I weren't going to pack his stuff up, but I it's packed good. his stuff I up. Strong. I packed his stuff up. I'm not doing it now. I'm not doing it no more now. He, he can 
seem to see to himself is a grown ass adult that can look after himself. Uh, if this were if this were my own lodge, if I had a if I had a lodge on a site, I would I would make sure it were facing the sun during the day. This isn't this is cool and then when the sun goes round at tea time it's then boiling like i've got no sun on p patio area and this room this room is cold yeah i've got patio door open and i've got that door open but i've just seen a woman over here in another lodge and i don't know whether it's a lodge or whatever but she's now sat well she's just gone in but she's sat with sun glaring on her I can do that at my own house and get a tan. Do you know what I mean? So we are we are gonna go home uh, in a bit. I am waiting for the dishwasher to finish so I can put stuff away that's we've used this morning and then only thing I have to do is empty the fridge. Uh, we all pop that we've got in. I've bagged everything else up. James used to bag all his stuff up on this thing here. <coughs> and I have what you call it. And I'm going to go home and have a nice sleep in my own bed. And don't get me wrong, I've loved the peace and quiet. I've loved it just being me and Jamie. It's been like... How can, how can I explain it? It's it's been like a what you call it when William when William goes down London, we'll have one less person in house, and then if they leave home, eventually. Now, I, now I know our Isabel will never leave home, and I, I know she'll always stay with us, but that is basically. If she don't come away with us, she looks after dogs type of thing, and she won't come away with us. She'd always she'd always stay at home. She's not very she's not really bothered, but I can see Scarlett moving out, and I can see William moving out. But then again, they might not. They might stay at home all the life and 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 stay with us. But I can't see that. I think William. I think William will go down London, what you call it, be offered a job and he'll probably stay down London. Uh, that that gives us somewhere to go if we want to go down London. Uh, we could always, if he's in a, like a two bedroomed flat, etc, etc, we could always go down and stay. Uh, Scarlet, I don't know about Scarlet. I don't know what Scarlet would, would want to do she'll probably get offered a job once she's finished a university when she's qualified in everything that she's doing uh like she's passed all a college accountancy accountancy jerry yeah she's passed all her accountancy uh college thing that she's done williams passed all his university stuff and he's qualified for what is it called a cfa he's qualified for a cfa exam now i don't know what this cfa exam is it's for extreme, extreme it's, it's one of the hardest exams you can take it's an ex it's an hard ex an hard exam to take only 45 percent of people that take it qualify actually pass 45 percent of people actually pass but what is the exam for though? What is it makes him uh, the end of his name? He'll have CFA. It's like a so I end his name. Advisor. So so I end his name. He'll have a financial advisor CFA. CFA. His name will be William Reese CFA CFA, CFA. Uh, because he's doing finance financial trading and financial trading and investment and investment. That's what is that's what he's doing in university and that's why he's going down London because he then works in a university with 
Americans, yeah. people that come from America, they come to this university, that's, that's what they do. Uh, and that's what William's doing. So he's, he's going to be going down London. He's going down London in September. He's coming home in, no, in December. He's coming home in December. And then he has to go back down in January. Yeah. He has to go back down in January. While April. While April. Uh, so he gets the, I think it's something like two weeks he gets at home for Christmas. And then we have to take him back down in January. And then he has to do January to April. And then once he's finished in April, he's done down London. So he's paid September to October, aren't he? Yeah. So he's got to pay October, October to November and November to December. Yeah. And then he, when, whenever he goes back in January, he rebooks them with the man and says, well, I want to come back down on this date. He'll have to fetch all this stuff home. We'll just keep it all packed. Uh, and then he will go back down in January and, and, and he'll pay January to February, February to March, March to April. So he'll pay an extra three months. Uh, and then he'll come home and then he's, then he's done. Uh, he's just got some exams to do then, hasn't he? Does yeah. he have to do his exams in London or up here? London, probably. He has to do exams in London, so we'll probably go down London when he's got his exams. Hopefully, I think he'll have finished all his exams by the time we uh, go away they, next year. Because uh, we're, we're not going away in May now, we're going away later on but not later on, later on, but later on in the time, basically. Uh, it is, it is quarter past 12. I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna pull car up and then we're gonna start packing it up. And then I'm gonna have a quick shower, get dressed and then probably set off because I want to be on because Taylor Swift's on. Couldn't really watch it last night because internet's a little bit shit. Well, it's a lot of shit. Uh, yeah, internet connection's a lot of shit. Like I can't upload no videos. All videos I'm gonna have to upload when I get home. So I've got like three videos. Uh, luckily I had videos up and ready to, to go. Uh, so I'm gonna have to edit all them videos when I get home. So yeah, so I've packed all the beer up. Jamie's packing all the books up that he's got on this coffee table. There's some at the on floor that needs pick, picking up. I'm then gonna go around and open up blinds and curtains. We're gonna pack case up. I'm gonna get a quick shower. I have to shave my legs because I'm going home in a dress. Uh, I have contemplated going home in jammer bottoms. That's what I've contemplated doing. And a baggy t-shirt. And I don't know whether I want to do that just yet because I can go on in my, my thingy crocs. But then I don't know whether I need to go to the toilet for a wee. But I should imagine that I could get away with waiting while I got home because it's only... How long is it to get home? Two hours-ish. Let's have a look. Google Maps, let's go Google Maps. Get the turn, turn by turn direction. Not now. So. Uh, 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 so let's. So, from where we are, uh, we can either go, we're going to go, we're going to go back over Umber Bridge, yeah? 
Are we going back over Umber Bridge or are we going other way? Oh, well, other way. Well, other way is one hour forty three minutes. There is congestion. Whichever way it says go, I'm going. Well, there's two ways on on my thing. It tells you you could either go the fastest route, which is one hour forty three minutes, or you can go over Umber Bridge because there's no congestion there over it's Umber Bridge. Road. Yeah. Uh, and it's one hour fifty two minutes. So either way, it's two hours uh, to, to, to get home. So that's that's what's going to happen. It's going to take us two hours to get home. I probably, if I went to the toilet and had a wee before we set off, and I just had one kind of pop in my drink for if I'm thirsty, I think I would be able to manage two hours. Fingers crossed. Uh, so that's what we're going to do. So if I set off at 2 o'clock, we're going to get home for 4. So 3 o'clock, we'll get home for 5 o'clock. So either either or, whichever couple of, whichever hours we're going to do. As long as I'm home for tea swizzle and she starts at 6-ish. So hopefully as quick as possible that we can set off so I'm home for tea swizzle. Right, that's us packed up and off home. It's going to be 2 hours before we get home. Uh, pointless sleeping because we were up we had to be up and off and we had to caravan at 10 o'clock i can stay in bed while 11 at home if i want to anyway yeah pure shite <laughs> that's what it is anyway we're off home and i will see you when i get home right we've just got off the motorways and the m1 and the a1 basically we're now on normal roads so we're going to be home in 20 minutes. Exit the roundabout onto Barnsley Road. Barnsley Continue on Road. Continue on 635 for three miles. Three miles takes me to not my house. But anyway, we are going home. Uh, can't wait to get in my own bed. Then Jamie turned around and went, yeah, but Isabel's been upstairs with Nala. And I was like, yeah have to change bedding so he's going for an air bed I want my own room and he's going to buy an air bed I don't care what he buys he just has to sleep downstairs <laughs> 